how to build a landing page under 10 minutes. You still think that that's impossible? I want you to say that no, this is absolutely possible and I want to show you how to do that with lead pages. Lead pages is a great tool, absolutely fantastic platform to build web pages, websites and landing pages. Let's jump straight to business. I want to show you how to do that. When you're going to get to the platform, you need to sign up or log in if you have an account. Uh, if you don't, just jump in, check the link in the description panel of this video to easily find it. And I want to show you that here on the platform, you can find the plenty of templates that can suit for your business. Uh, just literally any business. You can build it from a scratch or you can use a template. How to build uh, how to build a landing page within five minutes, I want to show you. For example, you have the travel agency. All right, let's build a simple and fast landing page for the uh, travel agency. All right, use this template. First of all, you need to give a name to your future page. That's a start. Now the process is downloading. The template is already here and I want to show you how to change here pretty everything. Okay, the Lado. There's a couple buttons. I want to show you what are the buttons and you will understand what's the mechanics of the actions here. Layout on the page layout, you can see all the sections they that are on the site. On the sections button, you can choose the section type and for example, blank and all the things here. Every thing that you see is drag and drop and you can drop it on this blue boxes you can drop it on this blue boxes here you cannot because this is a section let's drop it right here and then you can drop the widgets text and image image video button form line space icon and so on and so on there's a lot of things just to show you how okay and video how to edit all these things you will understand just in a couple seconds i want to delete this block i want to delete this section styles page background font styles and so on and settings uh it's a little bit later but for now all the things here, when you just running around the page, you can see that it contains some small things here. When you press in the three points, three dots, you can add it section settings. Now you can see the image that is on the background of the of this block, this section. So, for example, I told you already that we building, we building, let, okay, let's insert this one. It looks great, isn't it? Looks fantastic already. This is the text. I want to show you how you can add the text. Here on the settings of main content, you can see what is happening with the feed the container fill container automatically. I want to fill the container. Alrighty. Here you go. Something's working already. And now I want to change the text. I want to change the text. So for example, let's make Let's make it like this. Uh, 
let's make it like this. Okay, we changed the text right here, and we see that uh, it's pretty, pretty fantastic already. Let's press the preview. The preview button shows how your web page, how your landing page will be displayed in different types of uh, devices. It's pretty cool already. But I want to change, for example, the image color overlay. Let's try to make some new color, the warm one, and the opacity of this color will be like. like that or you can customize the color capacity 55 all right you're just clicking out and the changes are saved when you see that there's a button and you need to edit this you press to the pencil you can change the color of background or the text the background is okay, the text is okay. Here you can change the type of the button. Flat and square. That's pretty it, that's pretty it. Except that you need to add it the pop-up. The window that will appear when you uh, when someone will press the button, we can see that here's email and let's go, okay? We need to change the integrations. Uh, what's gonna happen when somebody types in the email? You will get the notification if you have no integration. What does it mean integration? If you add in an integration, there's a lot of services like active campaign get response mailchimp convertkit i think that you know them if you dealing with uh email marketing or in the with the online marketing you know all of them and if you have them you can integrate them if not you will get notifications to your email and that's it fields what does it mean here you can see that only email is available so we can add a field city last name comment first name postal code we need the first name and we need to change the places cool that's it that's cool and actions what will happen when the email is on default lead pages thank you page okay save and close here we can see that here on this section one there's a second column and when we press we can see that we can change a color for example right here but I want to make an image let it be another one for example this one okay cool that's it you have a web page on the 10 minutes as i told you thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed i hope this was useful check the link in the description panel of this video to find out more and to get your free 14-day trial of lead pages because this is excellent and perfect tool to build your own online strategy with with just drag and drop features
it's absolutely easy to use and I showed you how to do that. If you have questions, type in the comments. Uh, I'll try to answer and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much. Have a great day and bye-bye.